Hi everyone, how, how you doing? It's me, Joe, and today we are playing Exile, but on a different map. Um, I am hiding in this wheat. You see me? There I am. Yeah, this is a different map. It's called Bornholm. It's a, a map that's based in Denmark, I think. I thought to say something next to me there. I think it's just because I moved. Um, yeah, this map looks really cool. Like, you've got wind turbines. I don't. Do you have wind turbines in Altis? I think you might have. I can't remember. But yeah, there's loads on this map, it's great. I'll show the map now. So this is the map. <laughs> it's pretty damn big. Um, I'm here, near the Trader City. I started on the server, I think you had about 500 pop ups when you started, there might have been a thousand. And I spawned here, and I ran to the city, but I found a truck on the way, and I went and sold it at the Trader City. Um, and with all the money I got, I geared up quite a bit. I got this, I look pretty damn camouflaged. I look really cool. I love my current layout. But yeah, it is morning. It's early morning. See, it's 7 a.m. I think. Oh no, it might be night time. I think the sun's going down actually. Oh yeah, it must be. Oh, it must be night time. That's fine. We got night. We got MVGs. So that's cool. I'd rather work under night. But yeah, there's not many people on the server. There's only eight people on the server at the minute. Um, I'm playing a bit early. I should really play later on, but I need to get some of this recorded. So I think the only way to do it is to go to these missions. But it's got, it's a long run. But I think that's cool. That's where people are going to be. It's a mercenary group, so it's probably about 10 kilometers away. That's seven. It's pretty far. But yeah, I will. I will cut this out. I will cut this out. This um, this video. I said in the last ones that I wasn't cutting much out anymore. But this map, like, I kind of feel like you have to. Yeah, the sun's definitely going down. Uh, but yeah, I wanted to get my gun up. I wanted to play something a little bit different, a different map, because Altis is good, but like I was saying, it's like a desert. Like, it's just empty. Like you can't. Like, I love these sort of maps. Like you got these fields, you've got these mass fields. Look at me just hiding in these fields. There's more trees to hide in. It's just so much better place to sneak up onto someone. With Altis, it's like a massive desert with the odd bush in the middle. So you can't like get this, get the, uh, get the surprise on anyone. You can't sneak up on them. But with this map, you can. Oh, look at that. Perfect. That's what I wanted. Uh, yeah, this is a high loot server. I found so many cars lying about, and as you can tell, there's a bike here. I'll probably find a car on the way. This mission. Not. I, I didn't really want to go on a bike, but I, I like going on foot. But with only eight people on the server, I think it might be a bit safer. But there's so many spawn points around the map now. It's kind of hard to guess where people are going to be. With Altis, you can always tell where people are going to be. But on this, I don't think you really can. Uh, stuff's really expensive as well. When I geared up, um, I think the scopes cost like 300 pop tabs each. So yeah, there's always that. There's a car there, look. I don't remember G's on now, I think. I can't see. So yeah, everything's really expensive on this server. Which is kind of good. More realistic. It just means dying is going to be a lot more... Be a lot more worse off when you die and have to gear up. So I really don't want to die. Okay, it's open, it is open. There's nothing, nothing in it, so I'll probably drive it. It's got fuel. I'm in the back. <laughs> Get in the back. That's why I press driver's seat. There you go. There's loads of fuel in it and it seems to work. Great. Quite loud. So yeah, I don't know where to start a base on this server. So I'm going to start all over again because um, on the, the last server I played on, which is just on the Altis map, that base is gone. Uh, TJ. My friend TJ, he went on there and he had, went to my base and he said it was completely being destroyed. There's like one bit of wooden roof left. All my safes had gone and everything. So someone had gone blown up with like sexual charges or something. Which I'm pretty sure you can do. Or it just despawns over time, I don't know. But it's gone, either way. So that's why I kind of felt... It's, I'm not rebuilding another base on that server. I want to try a different server. I want to try a um, different map as well. Because I like this map. It reminds me of Taviana. I love Taviana. See, we'll have a little tour of it as we're driving along. So the hay bales you hide behind. Just got all these tree lines that are great for sniping from. And there are so many, like I said, there's so many cars in this server, it's unreal. There's another one there, look. So it probably is really easy to just keep um, selling cars. Beer transport, the robbers have taken off of all the beer. That was another mission, I think. 
Yeah, so it fails. If no one does the missions, they fail fail after a certain amount of time. I am really worried about mines. I don't know how expensive they are on this or how cheap they are on this, but if it's like if it costs 300 pop tabs for a scope, I think it's gonna be pretty damn expensive for a mine. But there are people probably on the server who are ridiculously rich. I'm sure they're in overnight and uh, early in the morning. There's not that many people as, if you play on it, as you can see now. It's probably really easy to just loot up. It's a cool little town. I could start looting, but I want to get some action. I've only got one mag. That's the one thing I've noticed. Um, another car. I logged out and I had a, um, a couple of mags in my backpack, and they're, they're gone as I've come back on the server. So I've got no pop tabs to buy any more. So I don't even know what I'm gonna do when I get to this place. I have to just swap guns out. Oh, there's a base up here, look. Circle base, that's something different. Not seen one of them before. Tra HQ. Okay, try to go up this hill without crashing. Cool little base there, I like that. Oh my god. Didn't see that laying there. Oh wow, wooden planks. Good little spot here on top of this hill. Overlooking everything. It's obviously locked. Just try it. This won't be it for a base door. I someone would be stupid to have this as their code. <laughs> Unlocked. That'd be great. Okay, we're nearly at this objective, so hopefully we can get up onto it and maybe change gun. I might have to get rid of this gun if I can't get any more mags for it, which would suck, but. What's something we have to do? The Punisher Squad. That means there's a base nearby. Oh, there is. People are built on top of hills. Wow, size of this base. So they've really spent some time on this. Let's get out of here. It's military loot there in that building. Might have to come back and check that out. Well, I'll put my car by this wind turbine, so I know where it is. Might have got a bit close here, though. Okay, so what is it that's actually here? A mercenary group, so there will be people here, play uh, AI. And I only have 10 bullets and I can only use this site, so it's going to be pretty damn hard to do anything here. So that's always fun. Oh yeah, I wanted to ask you guys as well, I'm thinking about uh, we're going back to Daisy, the Daisy mod. Um, I've been playing it for a while, like this last week, and uh, it's just so, so good. Like, I've, 
I stopped playing it ages ago because I played it so much I kind of got bored of it. And I, but then because I haven't played it for so long, I want to play it again. And I think about starting a series on it. So let me know what you think. I'd like to go back to that because that's what started my channel, and I think it's still good. It's actually really different now. The Daisy mod, like the vanilla Daisy mod, is actually so different compared to what it used to be. So I don't know what to think, really. But yeah, let me know if you'd be interested in that, because I'd be more than willing to do it. Okay, whatever it is, it's just over this crest, so... Crest this hill. So we try and get in this house. Might be good. Is that me they're shooting? There's a player in this house. I'm pretty sure it's a player in this house because that sniper shot there sounded like it came from this house. I'm scared to move now because they hear me. What to do? I'm pretty sure the AI couldn't see me, so I don't think they would have opened fire on me. Should just run in. I think the door's on the other side of the house though. Can you even get in this house? Can. Door's right there. They must have been shooting at someone in the house, surely. But all those traces coming at me, like they're shot, they couldn't see me. I'm confident they can't see me here because this is where I ran. I see the AI. They're coming this way actually. Is that this one? That's just like they're pushing up, so. I see one. Oh, should I sprint in? See, if I sneak up to it, they're going to hear me before I even go in. They must have seen me. <laughs> okay. They must have killed him. I think they must have killed the guy in this building. He's 
body's not in here. This is out the front. Could probably Bambi killer because of that. They must have just respawned, found a car. For one that respawned in one of these places. So yeah, they must have killed him when they were shooting him. I didn't see any message come up saying they killed AI. I need a drink. I'll wait a little longer. Just keep an eye on it. Okay. How is he a Bambi man? Like, look how far he's come to get here. So I'm guessing the tracer, he's either in, in he must his body might have despawned. But he was either in this house. Oh god, I'm stuck in a bush. I'm actually stuck. Uh he must have um been in the house at the front of it. Or his body's despawned, I don't know. Might be like on this hill here, which is probably my guess. Oh, a lot of them are dead. They just all laying down. Now a lot of them are dead. So he must have killed quite a lot of them. And there's his body. Look, there's another car over there. Looks empty. There's nothing on it. Let's see he's died and he just keeps just respawning and running back. Which is all I can think of. It's just this one guy left. Just gonna check that car. I'm in mean, this more than one person here. And they would have heard that shot, so they know I'm here. This car, this car needs to have guns in it because I need to switch my gun out because I just got got no ammo. Nine bullets could kill nine people. Nine bullets, but I don't think I'm good enough to do that. Yeah, let's check this and then we need to relocate away from that that spot there. I can't even see me laying on the floor though. Like this grass is great. So I mean, if I was an Altis laying in the middle of the desert, I wouldn't have been seen. I would have been seen, but on this, nope. I don't know if it's going up onto that hill. Or if that's a bad spot, because it's right next to where the AI are. Hills aren't always the best to hide in, to hide on. Because she has got no scope. Yeah, they are just over there behind by that thing, aren't they? So I need to be careful. Just run down here a bit, so we're in the bit of the defilade. That sounded like I came from the hill, that shot. I say shot me. Little hill here we could maybe sit on. I say hill, it's more of a slope, but not many people here. I think about playing on a first like hardcore server because I like third person, but I, I only use it because I know everyone else is. I ha I love playing a first person, like it's so much cooler. Like, look, so like, people can't see around corners and stuff like I do. They can only see you like if they actually look at you. So people have to look around corners to like see if they can see you. So you get the advantage on them so much easier if you play first person. Just the birds. I love the sounds in this game, on this map. I wonder if they leave, if they only leave if there's no one like, at the mission. Oh, there's a guy. 